everybody welcome to natural beauty kitchen um, this is a channel where I bring you along with my cosmetic formulation process even though I do not teach that much on this channel but I do share with fellow skincare brand owners my lab tool so in this uh, unboxing video I'm going to be unboxing to you the my latest lab tool the ones I got I recently got from amazing maybe this is going to help your brand out you know as cosmetic form later we use different lab tools to make our job easier and this is one of them this is a set of lab uh, spatula that we can use okay to take samples okay it's very i saw it on amazing i'm just bringing you along i've never used this before um, maybe it will help you out especially when you're taking little samples so this is what i I uh, got the name I think is um, I have a link in the description box below for where you can get your own so these are stuff you can use to take little I'm not sure about the quality but just uh, giving this a try for the first time uh, these are something you can use to take your sample out especially when you're using um, if you're using something like a botanical extractor you only take a little amount at a time right so this is going to help a long way if you uh, use the spoon and um, with this one you don't have to this is very good you can use this hand to take uh, to take your active especially powder even if it's uh, liquid active also okay so very very useful to me as cosmetic from later okay I think uh, it's more better to have this type of spoon than using this type okay we work with stainless steel keep that in mind so when you want to uh, scoop something out this set of spoon is very very useful so it's something you want to consider if you want if you're going to be formulating a lot it's going to help you it's going to make you look more professional it's, i mean the professionalism that this is going to add to your um to your brand reputation whether online or offline is huge okay so look in the description box below and these are very um very affordable prices uh, even though they say stainless steel i haven't used them before but so far so good they look sturdy okay they look sturdy they look okay so we hope you enjoy them then the second i'm going to set this aside the second lab cosmetic formulation uh, equipment that i bought If you want to learn cosmetic formulation, I take cosmetic formulation at stablecosmeticformulas.com. So basically, if you are if you are new into formulation, you can take my organic cosmetic formulation course. Link in the description box below. If you are an experienced formulator, you can join my formulation group where we take uh, we do one project every month. We have a lot of projects that we have done, and these are stable cosmetic formulas you can use to make uh, you know. Uh, skincare product to sell okay if you want to sell skincare product you, you we really greatly benefit by joining us at stablecosmeticformulas.com so now let's do the unboxing of this um, this lab equipment is very important is an electronic hot plate as cosmetic formulator we need electronic hot plate you know to make our job easier instead of having to be using the stove all the time or to be using a uh, water bath for to make oil for instance you don't need it okay you don't need water bath you really need a uh, hot plate so here is my hot plate i recently got this from amazon based on review from all from others so i said i'm going to share this with you so let's take a look at it and see And here is how it comes basically you you plug it and you do the settings here okay I've never used this before it comes with um, a manual which looks straightforward the power strength is 850 watt um, 
so far so green looks good okay electronic hot plate for cosmetic formulation if you're a cosmetic formulator you're going to benefit greatly uh, from an electronic hot plate it just makes your job easier from the review on this uh, um, hot plate I, I heard it's going to eat up very fast and later stabilize so we just hope it does what he says it promises to do okay so basically you just uh, plug it to be very very careful because it's very so I turned it on now I'm not sure if uh, the outlet I'm using is going to take will take all of this but let's let's see how it goes So basically you're going to do the settings here okay you can adjust the settings to your needs from here okay so you turn it up or down from here and from there you can just press set okay that's how you do it and uh, be careful when working with hot plate it can be very hot right so this hot plate from my own review is very good it takes time to eat up, but the moment it heats up, it's good to go. You know, hot plate like this, you can use it with a Pyrex cup like this. You can even use it with a borosilicate beakers. Okay, you can use it to melt uh, your oil. Very quick, all you have to do is just put it on. Once it's hot, okay, you put your oil and butter in there or your emulsifier. And that's it, you just set it. But the good, the very important thing you have to keep in mind when working with this <coughs> is that you have to adjust the temperature. If you do not want your oil to overheat, you should adjust the temperature here to, so I'm going to set it here to, to 70, 70 degree, okay, and I'm going to click set. So with that, it's going to stay at my 70 degree mark and that's what I want. I don't want to overheat, overboil or overheat my oil. So with that, I know I'm good at 70 degree. So it takes time to come up, but it will definitely come up. So in my upcoming video, you see me use this. If you want to know what is that I'm using, just know it's the electronic hot plate. Okay, I don't really know the name of the brand. All I see here is electronic hot plate. I have a link in the description box below for where you can get your home okay it's going to really help you when you are making you are formulating cosmetics that's about it for this video so these are the two things uh, that i bought to help my cosmetic formulation process to make it a lot efficient if you have never seen my video on my water bath look uh, in the description box below to see the type of water bath that i use to make my cosmetic products so that's about it for this video thanks for watching everyone